Brent Walsh tomorrow, being Cox Plate Day, most people will have huge anticipation about that. I think the race of the two days may well be the Manicato. And it's great that we've seen a capacity field uh, line up for this million dollar sprint. And for those who haven't been to Mooney Valley on a Friday night, the atmosphere on this event, the Manicato night there, Cox Plate Eve is fantastic. Uh, I think they're expecting over 10,000 people to come here. And I just know there's a lot of people in town in Melbourne for the whole weekend to come and see Winks on Saturday. And when you're in town and you've got not much else to do on a Friday night, it's a great way to um, spend the evening. And I was also glad to see the four international horses. Look, I think US Navy flag and Spirit of Valor look the two key chances. Yeah, Fleet Review and Intelligence Cross don't look as though they've got the class to be competitive. But still, four internationally trained horses in a Manicato stakes. Huge tick for the Mini Valley Racing Club. A lot of speed in this race. Malaguera, US Navy flag likely to go forward. Yep. Hootson, right down the bottom of the book. Sunlight's got a light weight, so the record could be on here. Miss Andretti's record? Yeah, I'd imagine they're going to go very, very slick, and um, I think the track is in perfect condition. Yesterday I had the opportunity to walk it with uh, track manager Marty Sinan, and he's taken a, a little bit of the edge in terms of uh, the grass off. He's got it quite short, um, so I'm expecting them to run pretty good time tonight if we don't get any rain, and I, I don't think that we will. You mentioned Sunlight, you mentioned Malaguera, um, Hootson can go quick. The horse that I quite like in the race, though, is Kementari. I think because of all that speed, um, to me, I was a bit surprised that they didn't run Kementari. The Godolphin team didn't run him in the Everest. I'm not quite sure of the situation surrounding the reasons why they didn't. But to me, he looks probably one of the best 1,400 metre, sort of 13 to 1,400 metre horses in the country. The fact that he's got the blinkers on, freshened up, back in trip to 1,200, speed on... If the track is playing fair, which sometimes at Muni Valley we can see, uh, yeah, sometimes it favours those closer to the inside. If they're running on by race number seven today, there's speed on. I think, I really think, uh, Kementari can sit off them and just go whoosh and hopefully we'll go straight past them in the home straight.